Look how white this is. And my walls aren't painted. Hi, my name is Grace Helbig. If you did not know, now you know your life is different now. I feel a variety of things. I feel pleasant, I feel crazy, I feel terrible, I feel wonderful. I just got back from two weeks out of town that included trips to New York City, London, and Dublin, and I feel like I lived a thousand lives in the last two weeks. Each cat? You only get nine. It was a whirlwind time, but now I'm back in Los Angeles and I am making this video for you and you know what this is already. It's the end of November, so time for some November favorites. Was that pleasing? Let's jump right in. When I was in New York City, I did a Sephora run and God, I love that little teaser zone. That was my failed game show title. And because it's holiday season, Sephora has even more great stuff in that zone. This is Tartlet's Teas. Wow, I didn't know that that's what this was called. <laughs> Drink every time she says teas, don't. That got fetishy and weird real quick, fun. It is not. This is by Tart, and it's a little eyeshadow palette. Pout, poutlet? What do you call, what do you call, what do you call, what do you call an outlet that, does, what do you call an outlet that gets upset that it doesn't get its way? A poutlet. Wasn't worth it. I know. I agree with you. It's a cute little travel eyeshadow palette that has a bunch of like brownish, neutralish colors, and there's some matte colors and there's some shimmery colors, and I like it very much. It's tiny, compact, and has all of the pretty shades that can make you pretty by the shallow societal standards that I'm not above admitting I adhere to. Because it makes me happy. What a tease. Next! Yeah. Hey, I say it. Hey, I say it. Hey, I say it. This has likely been in a favorites video before. <laughs> As that sentence has also been in a favorites video before. This is a blush from Stila. And it looks like this. Ooh, that looks bright. And it is bright. And I like it. This is a custom color blush, a self adjusting coral. What this blush claims is that it will adjust to your skin color, tone, whatever, so it looks different on everyone. I don't know or understand or care to really know or understand the scientific witchcraft behind it, but I do know that I like the way this blush looks on me, so that's cool. Cute! Next! Now, I've mentioned in many favorites videos that I love Saint Tropez, self-tanning, mousse, gels, all of it. Hey, here's my travel size one here, and this was gonna be in the favorites video, but this has been in so many favorites videos, so just know that I still continue to like this. I bought this in London at Superdrug. It is called Saint Tropez Instant Tan Wash Off Face and Body Lotion. It's basically like a self-tanning makeup that you just kind of put on your body and it tans you and it doesn't transfer. I used this when Mamrie and I went to the Banca Awards and it did not transfer. Ooh, demo? Okay, why not? I use my hands when I put this on, but it suggests that you use the mitt that the, here's the mitt. This is covered in self-tanner, just so you know. Oh, this is fun. Okay, so I just put some on and then you just do this. Oh, hey, hey, buddy. And it doesn't smell the worst. It spreads super easily and it feels really light and it says it takes like three minutes to dry. God, I feel like a fucking Home Shopping Network host. Ugh, oh, who knew I was gonna cross something off my bucket list in this video? Not me. Ta-da! Does that look different? Then you let it dry for like three minutes and you're good to like put clothes on, rub up against people, just grind, just shoulder grind on everyone. That's what we're all here for, right? That shoulder grind. Cute, I like it. And it washes off with water, just like actual makeup. Next, this! Hey, I see it, hey, I see it, hey, I see it. This is a scent. This has been mentioned, has it? Question mark? There's no one here to give you answers to this, Grace. I love Elizabeth and James Nirvana Black. It's what I wear all the time, but I was getting kind of bored with it, and then I found out that Elizabeth and James have two new scents, one's rose and one's bourbon, and I'm all about that bourbon. About that bourbon. Make it a double. This smells so good. Here I go trying to describe scent. It just smells good. One of the other things I bought in that teasy danger zone of Sephora is there's an Elizabeth and James kind of like gift pack that has Nirvana White, Nirvana Black, Nirvana Bourbon, and Nirvana Rose in a smaller little bottle for relatively cheap that's a fun like gift to give someone. It's fun to give the gift that insinuates that someone doesn't smell as good as they could. Cute! Next! Ooh! These! Hey, I see ya! Hey, I see ya! Hey, I see ya! Do you know what these shoes are? Cute as fuck. They're also Kate Spade. So I got these in New York City on my way to the Bancas in London because when I got to New York City, I realized that I forgot that I was going to the Bancas and I didn't pack a dress or shoes. Ha! Huh. I got them at DSW. They were a little bit more expensive than I wanted to pay for shoes, but they're really cute and so I'm putting them in this video so I feel like I got way more use out of them than just the one at the Bancas in which I can't find a photo of myself from that actually shows these shoes. So I haven't been able to Instagram them. So I just want you to know that I like these. 
And now my purchase is validated. <sighs> Next! Yes! Can y'all say that? Can y'all say that? Can y'all say This is the purse I carried to the bonkers. I'm just favoriting everything that I wore to the bonkers. The dress I wore is from Zara, which I love. And this purse is from Forever 21. Can you believe it? Yeah. I can because I just heard a bead fall right off of it. <laughs> Forever 21 is dominating all of the holiday stuff right now, so I thought I'd put this in this favorites video just to give you a heads up if that's something that you need or are curious about. Anyway, this purse was like 20 bucks, maybe less than that, I don't know, but it looks like, like my great grandmother gave this to me. Nah, she didn't give me anything except an innate ability to repress my feelings and never actually communicate. is these pants. Okay, I'll do a cutaway thing. These pants are from Zara. I got them when I got my dress for the Bancas, and I love these pants, and you probably hate them, and I don't care. I love them so much. They're a dropped crotch pinstripe pant that stops at the ankle calf. I mean, could they be more complicated? And could they be more a reflection of me in my current state? I wore these for like three days in a row in New York City and I haven't washed them and I put them straight back on when I got back to LA. That's not something to brag about. They're just so good! Cute! Next! Oh, let's put a food in. This! Can you see it? Can you see it? Can you see it? Can you actually see it? This is Boar's Head. Have you heard of that meat brand? <laughs> I didn't realize how much I would love the words meat and brand put next to each other until right now. Boar's Head, solid meat brand. These are these little snack packs that they make that have provolone cheese and sopressata. It's like salami-esque type meat thing. This is basically just a a slightly more sophisticated Lunchable and I love it. I have a lactose sensitivity, yes, but provolone cheese doesn't seem to mess me up and or I just don't choose to recognize when it does. Ah, fun. And they come with a bunch of different combinations of stuff. Some of them have these little like biscuit things in them. Oh, treat yourself, why don't you? This got sad. Okay, that's it for November favorites. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, hit this button right here and subscribe to this YouTube channel or give it a thumbs up so I can quantify my choices and let me know what you guys have been loving this month also one of my favorite things this month was um the london and dublin audiences that came to our this might get weird y'all shows thank you we had such an amazing time i hope you guys did too other than that i don't know i use this a lot the last two weeks when traveling clearly it's all washed off now oh my god did i just i think i dry heaved and burped and hiccuped all at the same time in my mouth Ooh, triple threat jealous i know you're not God.